what is up people how's it going back again after a long time with an application made with python skivy and matplotlib okay so basically it is going to generate graph of mathematical function and you can find the roots of equation using graph and you can find domain and range of a function other stuff related with the graph uh, of a mathematical function okay so let me show the demo uh, if i run my python file okay here we got a window okay now let me create a function mm, let's say i want to solve an equation or i want to create a graph of an equation let's say x to the power 5 minus 5x cube 5x cube plus 4x okay now i want to start from minus 5 and this is the value of uh, first value of x that i want to start from and this is the last value of x and the increment of uh, the first value to the last value is 100 that means it is going to increment by 0 0.01 okay now if i click the generate the graph button here we got a graph okay now if you want for a details view you can click for the zoom button and here you may select the area okay so this is the area this is the uh, this point is a root of the graph and this is the move button and if you click for okay now let me zoom in okay this is another uh, this is another root of the function okay now uh, you can you can have a more details view using this button okay so now i want to exit from my application and let me show you another demonstration the reason why i have to exit because uh, this is in development phase okay i didn't add any kind of function to clear my canvas yet okay so soon i will add a button that will clear my canvas and you may not have to exit from your application okay so um let me add a function called sine of x okay uh, sine of x and i want to basically i want to show the sine wave okay so i want to start from minus 50 let's say and i will the final value of my variable x is 50 and the number of domain for y is let's say 100 and okay here we got a sine wave okay now if i Oh, okay this is the sine wave and now you, you can have more values here or maybe 1000 10000 then you will get a smoother graph okay okay guys that's all today's video i will release a video on how i make this project from scratch so guys till then stay tuned goodbye